Customers may present an eScript in the form of a printed or electronic token. This video will demonstrate how to dispense an eScript from a token. Scan the token into the surname or drug field on the MINFOS dispense form. The script details will download from the PDS and populate the dispense form. If the patient can't be exactly matched to a patient in your database, the customer record window will display and you can modify the search criteria or add a new customer as required. If the patient exists in your database, but their details are different on the eScript, the update customer details window will display. In this window, select the update checkbox for any details that require updating in your database. Then click yes to update the patient's record. If no details are required to be updated, click no. If the details of the drug on the script cannot be exactly matched into the software, the drug recall or generic drug listing window will display. If the prescribed drug can be exactly matched to a drug in MINFOS, these windows will not be displayed and the dispense form will be populated with the script information and the eScript details window. Referring to the eScript details, check the dispense form is correct and make any required changes. Sometimes a prescriber may prescribe a quantity that does not equate to a quantity in MINFOS. The eScript details will display the prescribed quantity in the format it was prescribed. Ensure the quantity in MINFOS is correct. Enter the pharmacist's initials. The selected pharmacist must be set up in pharmacist maintenance as the type pharmacist for eScripts. If required, enter the dispenser initials. Press enter or OK to save and process the script. To finalise the dispensing, enter the pharmacist's details and their password. Add an annotation to the script if required and then press enter or click OK to finalise the prescription. The dispense label will print and the repeat token will be sent electronically to the patient or a copy of the token will print depending on which option was previously set up. The script options window will then be displayed. Make a selection from the list or scan the dispense label to begin the scan check process.